Hi, my name is Kira Durfee and I'm a student at the Yukon School of Pharmacy, working in conjunction with Dr. C. Michael White, pharmacist and distinguished professor at the school. I'm here to answer the question, do the Pfizer or Moderna COVID-19 vaccines contain formaldehyde or mercury, animal parts, or fetal tissue? This video is part of a series on the Pfizer and Moderna COVID-19 vaccines, and we hope that you find it informative. This general information is based on our assessment of COVID-19 vaccine literature and is current at the time of recording. This video is not meant to substitute medical advice provided by your personal healthcare provider. If you have a medical emergency, please call 911 right away. We have not received funding from Pfizer, Moderna, or any other group, and we hope that this video helps you to make an informed decision. Let's start by breaking this question down into some smaller parts. First, do the COVID-19 vaccines contain formaldehyde or mercury? You may be asking yourself, what's really in these vaccines? Both the Pfizer and Moderna vaccines include a fragment of mRNA, which is the key to your body preventing a future infection with COVID-19. That fragment is surrounded by a little bit of lipid so that the mRNA can enter your cells. Other than this innovative mRNA code, you'll probably recognize the other ingredients listed on the bio. The Pfizer vaccine contains lipids, potassium chloride, potassium phosphate, sodium chloride, sodium phosphate, and sucrose. The Moderna vaccine contains lipids, cholesterol, tromethamine, acetic acid, sodium acetate, and sucrose. So neither of these vaccines contain harsh chemicals such as formaldehyde or mercury. Next, let's answer the question, do the COVID-19 vaccines contain animal parts? The mRNA fragment in these vaccines is not taken from living cells, and there are no animal parts in the vaccines. So these vaccines are compatible with vegan philosophy. All vaccines at some point in the development of the technology or the product itself have been tested on animals. However, the Vegan Society notes that it's not always possible or practical to avoid medical products or procedures that have been refined or tested on animals. Finally, let's address the question, do the COVID-19 vaccines contain fetal tissue? Neither the Pfizer nor Moderna vaccines contain fetal tissue, and nothing injected into the patient is derived from the cell of a fetus. Both of these vaccines utilized fetal cell lines to confirm that the vaccines worked during their testing. The cell lines originated from two elective abortions in the 1970s and 1980s, but in the last four to five decades, these cells have multiplied to form many unique cell types, including the lines used today. Again, the mRNA in these vaccines is synthetic. It wasn't grown in an animal or fetal cell, and no animal or fetal parts are included in the vaccines themselves. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video, and I hope that it helps you to feel more informed about the COVID-19 vaccines. Please feel free to comment any questions that you have and check out other frequently asked COVID-19 vaccine question videos on the Yukon Pharmacy page.